Observe how the concrete is used for its raw and unpretentious honesty, contrasting with the pretentious ornamentality of the Victorian buildings of the parade, no. rather than hiding the shadow. Oh, it really takes it out of your shoulders. I never quite bring myself to hate these poor sick bastards. I try not to kill them. Sometimes. I don't even know what for. Because they're still people. Hey, a oh, bit of that. Now, try to behave whilst you're in the village, okay? Hello. Would you like to donate to our Uncle Jack charity drive? On your trolley, you huffy wee fuck bumper! Ollie! Oh, my goodness! You're Ollie Starkey! It's Ollie Starkey! Fuck the lot of you! Jack's a collaborator and a traitor! Ah. <clears throat> we all get what's coming to us in the end. This is where they hanged Mr. Cranmer, isn't it? And Mr. and Mrs. Lashford. Aye, Tommy and the Lashfords. You see those bits of rope? Why didn't the Germans just arrest them? I think we thought they'd be happier if they didn't have to. And dead men tell no tales. Did you help? Nay, but I didn't hinder neither. Does that mean you're just as guilty? You're full of questions today, aren't you? Walk around just like that. It ain't natural.
wish you wouldn't take all those drugs, Ollie. You don't think clearly enough as it is. What makes you think you can wear that? You frightened me half to death wearing that. That's <laughs> the one what's done it. <laughs> the haves from the have-nots since 1829. Better skulk past them or it's going to be a bit of a ruckus. There they are! Stop them! Right there! Vengeance is mine, saith the Lord! <laughs>
I might come and make. Black dog? No. I've got a wife. <laughs> oh, That's the one that did it. Say good night. Black dog.
Do like I've told you, Meg. Don't do like I do. each according to his ability. Ollie, I didn't ask you here, did I? If you take enough joy, sometimes one forgets the silliest things. People in town are getting a tad bit skinny. I think they're starving to death. And they're in the streets in fucking rainbows. Have you not noticed? Have you had your joy, Ollie? Why are you all wearing those ridiculous new masks? You should get one. They shape your face into a smile. And when you smile, you can't help being happy. You were kind to me, even when I got confused. I had no one else to turn to. Oh. Ollie. We have to tell people. They need to know the truth. No, Ollie. People do not need to know the truth. Truth is the enemy of happiness. Isn't that the decision we all made? Oh, but you know the truth, don't you? There's not a thing I can tell you that you don't already know, is there? No. It's better not to know. You, of all people, should understand that. I'm truly sorry about this, Miss Bing. Help! There's a donor in my... Ah! Ah! Is this some sort of silly prank? When I left the village, I thought you people knew what you were doing. 
Turns out, well, I've been keeping to myself. I have a pillbox in my kitchen. Would you mind terribly bringing me my joy? Oh, no, I can't. Please, Ollie. You were never cruel. I'm a soldier, ma'am. They teach you to be cruel. I need to see the executive committee. They won't listen. You'll only upset them, and then they'll take more joy and forget. They don't want the whole truth. No one wants the whole truth. You know what, Miss Bing? I'll come back. I'll come back when you're in your right mind. No! You can't, please. I, I'll take you to the executive committee. I'll walk you there. Anything. Just please give me my joy. I need my joy. Why won't you give me my joy? Sure, I'll go get it for you right away. Now, where would the woman stash her joy? I'm afraid joy is after my time. Here we go. She certainly hates to be off her joy, doesn't she? You're not going to give it to her. Ooh, I don't think she likes him very much.
This is what you were looking for, wasn't it? I'm afraid I can't let you have it. Why the fuck are you doing this? You evil downer bastard! I am going to kill you! I am going to kill you! Sorry. I need my words to stick in your head instead of flying right out the other ear. I've got to answer the blower. People depend on my decisions. She's got her own pneumatic. I better answer it. Who the hell is Clive Birthwhistle? You should find out if she likes him or not. You can't trust her, of course. Maybe there's a letter or something somewhere. They're going to need an answer right away. You don't know how critical my answers are. Okay, Mr. Birthwhistle, you can have as big an office as you like. Mmm, that doesn't sound like Miss Bing, does it? This is all some clever joke, isn't it? <laughs> it's terribly funny, Ollie. Let's just call this a prank, and you can untie me now. Please. Miss Bing? Is everything all right? Uh, I'm sorry, but I shall have to enter the premises. Who's that? Why don't you go find out? If you're going to talk to that Bobby, you can't do it looking like Ollie Stark. Who the hell am I supposed to look like then? Maybe there's a maid's uniform in the house somewhere. Well, that's my regular off-site executive committee meeting. Won't they be surprised to find you've tied me up? What unconvincing lie are you going to try to fob them off with? You better answer it. What do I see? Tell them you're the general and the meeting's been postponed. Ollie, she's going to scream if you don't gag her. <laughs> 